Hey guys, Clyde here live at Leechburg Lights. I want to welcome you today. I have something awesome I want to share with you. What you're looking at right now, this is the brand new power distribution board uh, designed completely 100% by Andy Harrison. When we look at the board, you'll notice that we have a uh, main power input. This power input is uh, large enough to support up to a 30 amp or a 10 gauge wire that you can connect directly from your power supply into this unit. And that allows distribution of your 12 volt or 5 volt, whatever that you're, whatever voltage that you're running for your pixels or for your RGB, whatever it is, this can handle uh, six different outputs. Each of these outputs are fused with their own individual um, automotive style blade fuse. What this helps do is helps create a very simple way for you to distribute the power from your power supply out to the back end of your pixels. Many people use 5 volt pixels as I do and this is a perfect way to add power injection onto the back end. Now if we turn the board around you can see I've already got some pigtails connected to these. Uh, if we turn the board around you can see um, what we have is we have a uh, uh, a set of six outputs. They are labeled very clearly, positive and neutral. And uh, as you can see, I've I've hooked up my three core, um, uh, my three core connectors, and I have these are the male ends that I have connected to them because I run power injection outside uh, using the male, the female ends to catch it with, and the male ends up going out to my individual prop. So I have my method for distributing power but now I have a distribution board which allows me more than one individual string to go out to my uh, for example my mega tree well this power distribution box can handle six times two is uh, 12 that that'll handle 12 of my uh, 16 strings so what I'll do is I'll pick up another one of these power distribution boards the power distro board from Andy and I'll go ahead and install both of these in the case along with my E682 or say my Falcon F16 V2 and I'll be able to run power injection right off of this board which is has a fused connection so uh, why don't we go ahead and get this baby installed but before we do that I want you to take notice that the board measures literally less than two square inches in any direction. So this is a very, very small board. With that, why don't we go ahead and jump in and get this little guy installed right into our uh, enclosure. Right now I'm gonna put it with my E682, which uh, runs my Megatree. So here we are. We've got our power distribution box wired in to my first power supply. This power supply, if you follow the lines, runs all the way over to the left side of my E682. This is the uh, controller that runs the mega tree, as I said. And it does have two power supplies because I ran 1600 pixels, 100 per output off of this controller uh, this year. Last year it only ran 1000. Uh, so I, I run two power supplies and each one controls half the board. And what I wanted to do is obviously I need um, uh, 16 power injections, or 16 is a good number, so, well actually 8 is a good number. There's only 6 on here, so what I'll do is I'll go ahead and purchase another one of Andy's distro boxes, and, or uh, distro boards, and uh, I'll go ahead and add it somewhere you know, right in about the same area. I'll then go ahead and run these pigtails through the bottom of the box so that I can connect in with some of my standard uh, extension cords. Now, I want you to all notice that uh, I don't have these actually connected in to anything. These are the data pins. If you look at the E682 here, you can see that I have uh, my, my brown wire the, uh, is the uh, neutral and my blue is my positive. I followed suit with that on the board here. So this is our basic setup. We've got power coming from our side of the board that's going to be controlling the pixels that's going to be receiving the same power from that same side of the board so this distro unit and this side of the board are going to work hand in hand I'll be able to power two strings with one output I believe that's what I've been able to do in the past so uh, that's the that's the next step with uh, with the power injection okay guys that's going to just about wrap it up here uh, if you have any questions about Andy's new power distro board you can get on the forums at uh, 
Falcon Christmas. That's where uh, a lot of the talk is going on. If you're also on some of the Facebook groups, there's a lot of places you can ask questions over in that area. That's where I spend most of my time as well as Andy does. But uh, just in general, uh, drop us a line here at leechburglights.com or uh, just leave it down below the video. And uh, let me know what you think of the board. I really like this. I think this is an outstanding idea. Um, it was it was awesome that Andy went through all the work to uh, to develop this on his own. And uh, my hats off to him. I'm gonna uh, be happy to add this into every single one of my controllers in the coming year. All right, guys, take care. Thanks. Bye.